Alrighty, how's it going, everybody? It's me, Silver Supreme, and welcome back to some more Atomic Heart. Okay, let's let's continue with this seeker facility. Oh, hey, buddy. Uh, be really good or really bad. That was a door. What the hell is this? Uh, you shocked to change their polarity. Uh Oh god. <laughs> uh Oh. song oh. testing ground one's magnetic and mechanical workshop is responsible for one supplying samples used in all tests and research activities two manufacturing external casings for piston type and thermal machines three regular and cylindrical surface grinding as well as spark erosion treatment for machine parts So maybe if I hit these top parts. Okay, I I got scared. I literally thought it was gonna crush me. Okay. Hope you don't crush me. There's a loot box over there. Drink. I think I have the fat boy on lock. Oh. oh my god. I kind of want to probably invest in that rocket launcher. Because I know it'll probably save me one of these days. Huh. Oh, there's a hole up there. Something is perving out right on the ground. Thank you, cute. Hole. Okay. Well, I guess I'm going up here. Going through the testing facility where no one knows nobility. And this is a blood hole. What the hell is that? A special transporter for valuable cargo or 
Comrade Lutyagin, according to the employee's facetious name for it. Valuable cargo is all well and good, but why is it stuck there like that? Huh? Its base features a prototype of a perpetual motion engine that forces the... Boring. Give me the short version. Once released, it moves quickly between certain set points. It's dead still. Looks like your perpetual motion engine is busted. More than profit. One out of 24. Let me get There's a whole bunch of these. Bastard. I know that these bastards will try to run around. No idea what this is. I see. Chicken house. Okay. It sounds like those things are going to pop up more later and it's going to piss me off. Testing ground one's thermal machines comprise of an Archimedes screw powered by the thermal emissions from a uh, thermal element. The machines generate 2 million kilowatt hours of electricity a month. Enough to keep the entire testing ground operational for a year. Oh god. Bastard just drop kicked me from that way. I'm gonna save up my energy. Oh, look at that loot box. I guess I could use a shotgun. I've been neglecting it for a while. Okay. I got this area. Some other stuff over there. Save station. More loot. I'm just crossing stuff a little bit easily now. Does that say? Uh, I can't read it. Hear something walking around. Fading data. Right. Something for the pistol. More of these sex dolls. Attention, all testing round one personnel. To avoid unnecessary accidents, please leave the testing zone as soon as the testing on alarm is activated. Remember. A Soviet worker is always aware of their environment. This goes double for facility 3826 employees.
Uh huh. Right, uh okay, just jump across here or go across there. Uh right, uh, made it across. this oh it's like a switch yeah that thing Ugh. okay oops okay so I have to get the blue to the center Jump up, you son of a bitch! Okay, that that works. I am it's no surprise to find access to modern weaponry deep within civilian testing grounds. Science and war have always gone hand in hand. Is that what your programming tells you to think? Shall we say that's what I believe. Even the cartoons you're so fond of started out as revolutionary intelligence gathering methods. Lamentable though it may be, war is the engine of progress. I don't know where an AI glove could possibly get beliefs from, but if you ask me, I'm all about peace. And cartoons. Fading data. It goes somewhere, but what's over here? Oh, so damn my Grab all these little bulls. Okay, that little uh puzzle room weren't too bad. I thought it was gonna be a lot worse. Here another one of those things. I think that's the one, well, probably one we already got. Yeah, I assume that's probably one we already got. Oh! Hello? Eh! Give me this. I got me a whole bunch of loot this time around. I think we got all the ones in this room. Oop. I have. Actually, can you? I got some new stuff for my shotgun. So yeah, I, I, this is the one I got. I just got let me do the extended magazine.
guess that... I guess the basic grip. Look at that, all this extra loot paid off. Decreases energy expenditure, yep, let's do upgrade that. Upgrade the rate of fire. Increase the range. Hey, I'm kind of happy. Like, most of this stuff will definitely come pay off. Yeah. I got some upgrades. Could use this for work. All right, let's bug out of here. Oh, I gotta wait for this to come back now. It's rising. Uh, hello? What the fuck game? I thought it was bugging out for <laughs> Clean up. I don't know what that achievement progress is, but it says one out of eight. I'm assuming the do it a facility. I would like to get some sights, but look at this shotgun now. How many shells can it hold? Is it double? Oh yes, yeah, doubled. Where the fuck am I? Oh, there's a carcass over here. Oh, this is, uh... By the shack. Oh, there's still some stuff up there. What do you gotta say, carcass? You got zapped? Ivan Chisov jumped out of the plane when it was shot during the war. 6,700 meters. American Nick Alchemade, also in the war. 5,486 meters. Alan McGee, a bomber pilot, 6,700 meters again. What are you talking about? Who are you talking about? People and the height of their fall. They survived, despite not having a parachute. I fell down from Chelomay's pathetic 3,500 and got flattened. Hmm. How, how do you know those names? I've never heard of them. I wish I knew. As I was falling, I started flailing and screaming, and suddenly thought turned on and started sending me these names and numbers. I know a lot of them. There are over two dozen. Except that doesn't matter because I am not on the list. Oh. Well, live uh, and learn, right? That was ass and I. I guess I'll go back in this house. Uh, miss some stuff. Oh God, I hear more of those chicken walkers. Run! Hmm, actually, uh... What will it be, Major? Can you? Hmm. Yeah, I'm not using the PM right now. No, yeah, since I'm not using it, I could just disassemble this. Uh, car? 
I can drive? Okay. I had no idea I could drive. Locked. What else is new? Charles? Open it. Unfortunately, I lack the ability to unlock doors. You're like a broken record, you know that? I'll deal with it. Ah! I am probably about to get fucked up right here. Uh. Hey, a Valon. Sweet. Oh, nope. I'm getting up here. You can't believe me. That car is probably fucked. Okay, what do we have here? Are you planning to disable the Hawk? It isn't responsible for opening the VDNH's doors, you know. Uh, w well, I gotta do something, okay? I'll start with the Hawk. A lot of those jerk ass robots. Yeah, it looks like I gotta like pretty much blow that thing up. All right. Hey, baby. Oh, God. Ah. All right, you're in my shit is happening. It's alert level to maximum major. Okay, okay, I'm growing. It's the Hawk service button. What does it do? It will cause the Hawk to land so it can be serviced by a technician. How long will it stay there for? If it fails to make contact with a technician, not long. What are you planning? I'm going to take a ride on the Hawk and get a better view of the place. Maybe I'll see something. There's no way in hell I can get on top of that. I had no idea what the hell. Can I actually jump on this thing, or the game is bullshit at me? What should I do? Hang on to this handle or something? Hold on tight. Hawks are not designed to be ripped. Oh, Jesus Christ! Oh, so I was supposed. Game, this would have been useful knowledge if you told me all those eons ago. I can. I, this is literally a test of sanity at this point. Oh, Lord. Oh, don't. I don't need this shit in my life. So I was supposed to grab onto this. I forgot this thing's like never said it's the yellow part. Okay. Maybe I can slide down a cable. 
Oh, now you can do all this magical shit, you bastard. Interesting fact. From a bird's eye view, you can see that the grass in the park was planted in the shape of the peaceful atom. A bird's eye view? I don't understand. Ugh. Look at that, it's that thing again. Be careful. Hog 7 units are quite dangerous. Oh, come on, it's freaking adorable. Oh my god, that thing is running on negative frames. How do you like that? Okay. Okay. Oh my god. Oh, I I have no idea what the hell is happening. Ow! Oh my god. Who's the man? This thing is like it's literally here fighting a stroke. I have no idea what the fuck. I have no idea what's happening. Ah! I'm, I'm just shooting this shit. I have Lights out. I am about to die. Oh Okay. I I am I healing or what? Oh my god. I <laughs> I have no idea. I have no idea what is happening. Good God. That, that oh god I think that that was the only time I actually hit it with that thing oh my god that was a boss like that was I <laughs> I, don't, I don't know that was literally like fighting like Why does this I, say I don't I, I thought you didn't care about gods or religion in the Soviet Union we don't care about the opium of the masses, but there are gods and then there are gods. Take Prometheus, the god of fire who brought light and warmth. 
Prometheus was actually a titan, not a god. Hey, watch your step, okay? So what's a god? Somebody who protects you, who teaches you how to live, who's wiser and smarter than everyone. Pretty impressive, isn't it? You can really tell we're on the threshold of something really incredible. Why are you supposed to be over here? I just wish there weren't bodies all over the damn place. The celebration will be held on Monday in honor of national polymerization and the launch of Collective 2.0. All the highest ranking members of the Communist Party will be here. I can fix all this by then. I certainly hope your optimism turns out to be justified. Else, in the Soviet Union, we're the gods. Everybody who works for the good of others, who brings new knowledge... To More locked doors. Who the hell keeps locking everything? Whoever he is. I bet he's got a goddamn combination lock on the John at home. The system of mirrors will. Yeah. Uh. Focus beams of light yeah. on the model of our solar system hanging above the entrance to the world. The man of science and the labor is the new god of planet Earth, Homo Futurum. Uh, That's thank a you. Secret. Um, don't forget your camera again. Okay, next question. I I am just flabbergasted by that fight. That was literally fighting ADHD incarnate. My eyes were hurting like shit trying to keep track of that thing on screen. My God. I, like the safe stage is all over the damn place. I was like, we got a safe stage right here. Access granted. Just, just give me something, please. I uh, just stock up on those. Uh, can I make that rocket launcher thing? I need a. Uh, uh, yeah, I, I'll, I'll, I'll get to hop to it. Uh, I guess I'm gonna head to this other tester facility. Oh, Jesus Christ, go! Just, just go! Just go! Hate you. I don't got time for you. See something on the ground. Oh, God. I don't know what the hell that is. facility blah 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 you are all the way down here can't see me All 
right? And yeah, if I just drive down, it's a bank. I, I think a robot's hitting me. I cannot be fucked. All right, I guess this is a facility. On the enemy's alert level data, you are. Fucked. Are you stupid? <laughs> oh, this looks like the entrance to the thing. Right, there is a two. I'm fine in here. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ. I, 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 you all, you all die someday. Hey, Mikhail, there's something wrong with the repair vendor in the building over by the drainage pipe. I asked it for a toolbox, but instead of that, a crazy bumblebee flew out and tossed me a huge container. I can't even get inside it. Go check it out, okay? Nobody up the ass, up the ass, the ass, up the ass, up the ass. Okay, I'm guessing the facility is over here. This has to do something. Uh, okay, I gotta go over there. Yeah, I guess I gotta hack this camera, open it, that door. Okay. Oh, let's hop to it. Jesus. I mean, Comment in this game is like half the time is either completely like a drunken affair or straight up ADHD like that ball of death. The Incredibles bot. Uh, there we go. Uh, back down we go. This joint, the Kalashnikov is good, but it burns ammo like a bitch. I think I'll probably just replace this with a uh, rocket launcher. And I'll probably like, pick up the pistol. I'm pretty sure the pistol will probably be pretty solid. Okay. What the fuck? You you got a problem with me, bitch? Ah! Tells me it's about to get fancy in here all of a sudden. Oh, let's go to the next facility. Alright. Everything is gonna drive crazy. Oh, I gotta delve down here to get these upgrades.
Hmm. Ah, another dungeon. This is the testing ground, Major. There should be weapons here. Testing ground, dungeon, same difference. Let's find the stuff and get moving. Honestly, game, you're so, getting too self-aware for my likey. Uh, okay, I got some more. Hmm. Back. Mm, I'll upgrade that. Uh, I need to get that. Uh, hey, I'll save up some polymers. Okay. Uh, that looks aft. That definitely looks, looks aft over here. What the hell are we about to be fighting in this mess? Like there's sex spots all over the floor. I didn't realize our character doesn't have footsteps. <laughs> Grab all of these things. Because I need to upgrade my weapon. Hopefully by the time we finish this area, I can get me like the rocket launcher or even the the super zapper. All right. What test are we going to be doing in here? Playing this sensual music. What the hell is this? The dreams and aspirations of facility 3826's scientists know no bounds. The daring Soviet scholars want to know, how can I make a Soviet citizen's life in space as comfortable as possible? What conditions are key to making their stay outside of the Earth's atmosphere indistinguishable from what they're used to? Oh, my... At supposed testing to... round six, you can observe one such experiment. Will it be possible for future spacefaring generations to watch movies in zero gravity? The answer is, naturally, for the Soviet citizen, nothing is impossible. Okay, that doesn't work. Hmm. That's a door. Oh. Did that do anything? No. Okay, uh, I think I had it right. <laughs> and I think if I flip it one more time, it should be good. Yeah. 
Oh wait, I think oh I have to unlock it. I forgot. Uh sorry, can I excuse me, sorry, can I bullshit around this? Yeah, I forgot to unlock it. Shit. Okay. This one just moves this other one. <laughs> Which one is actually large? know how to do it. I just gotta flip it in the right order. Yeah, that's the locked door. Let's see, can I can I do it midair like a jackass? <laughs> okay. Right, I'm assuming I have to get this part flattened, so uh Even this doesn't get me as close to it. Oh, Jesus. All right, uh, where the thingy? Oh, hang on, I gotta flip it back.
it sends it back to the top. Yep, from over here. Uh, okay, I, I have to get up. Uh, okay, hang on. Uh, where, where's the, uh, that's that one. So that's like two turns away. So this one, two, hoping this will work. Uh, I see what I gotta do now. Okay, there we go. They come up here. Open this damn lock. Oh, I can't see. It's dark. All right. So now this is unlocked. I think this should be it. Oh, no, I was off by one. Yeah, I was off by one. Hi. Uh, actually, hit it. Time after that. There we go. What in the hell is happening with all these sex dummies everywhere? It, like, were the people really just bored putting up these damn horny sex dummies and robots everywhere? <laughs> Nothing back here? Surprising. Damn loot. Death to the machine. If it isn't Comrade Lutyagin, you seem rather gloomy. Is something wrong? No, I just feel like I had a bad dream or something, and, and this guy was there. Pull yourself together. You haven't slept in a long time, Major. I feel like I'm asleep right now, and I'm having a nightmare. It's no nightmare. It's a mirage. Hmm. Well, actually, I'm going to put a save right here, and I'm going to call it a night, folks. All right, so we got to have to do some more puzzles uh, when I come back to this. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Leave a like, comment, and subscribe to the channel if you would like to see more. And when we return, we'll complete a, well, uh, no, a glass darkly is the quest we're doing. Well, we'll complete this secret lab. As that said, this is Solo Supreme, and have a great day. Now this one is pure niceness.